Come on, Vivian! Faster! Whoa! Mallory, slow down! It's not even open yet. We still have to wait. So many people. It's Chef Zen! What do you expect? People were I'm not sure if this is a good idea. Not Calm no, down. Mallory. Everything will be okay. You'll do great. I really am not certain about this. <sighs> Keep yourself together, Vivian. You can do it. <sighs> Alright, I got this. Look at this place, it's huge. Very huge. I'm not sure if I should feel excited or scared. You should be excited, of course. Gosh, I can already imagine it. Imagine what? Vivian Gomez, the first chef and win of Delarine City. Just think about it. Uh, think about that. There are so many people who could do better than me. Don't get your hopes that high. I'm pretty sure all these contestants are just at the same level as you. And how can you be so sure about that? No way. She's here too? Who's here? And who is that? That's Zuri Miles. A media influencer. She has a YouTube channel with over 300,000 subscribers, and she's mainly known for her culinary skills. She's one of my inspirations. Wait, if she's already a known influencer, why is she here? Uh, hello? She's not a certified chef. She wants the title. Duh. I can't believe I get to see her in person. But now that she's here... I'm not sure if I could do this. There's no way I could beat her. Oh my... There you go again. It's not about winning. It's about showing what you're capable of. Just do your best. But... Huh? What's going on? I can't see. Guys, look up. I think it's about to start. Today, the biggest culinary competition in the whole world known in the 37 countries, where people from every corner of the world came out with a lifelong dream to be a world-known title holder of Chef Sen Mania. The smash hit from across the globe has finally come to the city of Deloraine. Amateur cooks have to compete under intense pressure to see if they have what it takes to enter the chef's zen kitchen. But first, they must impress three professional culinary figures. Lindsay Davis, the queen of world-class menus in the nation. With the power of technique and creativity, I've made my own restaurant dynasty. Albert Laurent, known for his bold and strong flavor combinations. I've been practicing culinary arts for years, and therefore my skill will be delighted to you all. And Chef Sen Mania USA's fifth season champion... Wait a minute, is that... Kyle Rivera. Chef Sen gave me the chance to prove what I can really do. Let's repeat the process and compete once again. Only one of these home cooks will be the city's first ever title holder of... Chef Sen Mania. No way, this can't be happening right now. That guy, who I bumped into the other day, the one who messaged me last night, is one of the chefs and judges?! Good 
Right here in this very room, you're looking at the best amateur cooks in the city. That is a big achievement. You all should be very proud of yourselves. But things are about to change because we are taking you to a whole new level. Oh no, why did I even agree to this? The winner of this contest will receive $200,000. But that's not all. You will also be getting something that is way more valuable. The Chef's Zen Trophy. And with that, you'll be entitled as a Chef's Zen winner. You should all know by now that this won't be easy. In order to get there, you must impress us enough to give you this. The Chef's Zen White Jacket. You will be given one hour to make your signature dish. So cook as if it's your last. And we'll see each and one of you later. This is way too much pressure for me. Do I really have what it takes to achieve my dream? <sighs> Looks like there's only one way to find out. out there was so enticing. I cannot wait for this to start off. I see a lot of potential in all those cooks. This will be interesting for sure. Is everything all right, Kyle? Hmm? Ah, yeah. Everything's fine, Miss Davis. Care to explain why you're so silent then? I'm just thinking, Chef. It's no big deal. If it is no big deal, then tell us what you're thinking. I'm thinking that we should get to our places and start this competition already. We don't want to waste time now, do we? That isn't the actual reason, is it? But you do have a point. We shouldn't be standing here any longer. Right. Well, what are we waiting for? Let the feast begin. The competition has begun. Several home cooks from every corner of the city have tried to make their way to woe the judges to get the white chef jacket. The culinary stars have seen some amazing dishes. These are pan seared scallops with some butter lemon sauce. This is an apple and blueberry pie with cinnamon pastry. I have made a honey cake topped with toasted pecans and a honey caramel on a blueberry coli. And some. Bizarre plates. What are you cooking? I am making scrambled eggs with creme fraiche and caviar and eggshell cups. Wait, what? I'm preparing a lemon herb alligator stew and... Well, I'm sorry, did you just say alligator? Uh, that's right, chef. Yes. I am making uh, saradaki tuna with... Uh... Well, before you forget, you better get started because you only have five minutes to get it done. Some home cooks have tasted triumph. That has got to be one of the best pies I've ever tasted. It is a definite yes. Thank you so much, Chef. Yes! 
That dish is complete harmony. Perfectly done. You have my yes. <gasps> that cake is right on the money. Get over here and get your jacket. <laughs> Thank you so much, chef. <laughs> I did it! While others were rather bitter than sweet. You don't seem to be in a hurry. You're very slow. I wouldn't call it slow, chef. I only have one chance to prove myself, so I'm being quite careful. I consider myself to be more methodical. Methodical? I'd rather use the word slow to match your incoordination. Uh! I have been unemployed for about a year, but it's not that I couldn't find a job. It's just that I have not really thought about what I wanted to do in life. Oh, really? But I guarantee you, I know there are a lot of people out there who are very skilled, but I don't think they've been working hard as I have. Excuse me, honey, but you just said you haven't been working for the past 12 months. <laughs> I always follow what's on my mind, and right now, my mind is saying that this dish will for sure give me the white jacket. Yeah, that's great, but uh, my mind says that you only have 20 seconds left, so you better hurry up plating, otherwise we're tasting fresh air. Uh, okay! If you made this for me, I'm not sure I'd be happy with it. <laughs> I'm, uh, sure it tastes better than it looks. Jeez, what did you do to the salmon? I, uh, baked it for about 30 minutes. It looks like you baked it for 30 days. Wow, you really like spicy food, don't you? Yes, ma'am. I don't. Looks hideous. It tastes pretty bad, too. But how? I had people who tasted that dish, and they said it's good. Oh, really? Are they still alive? This is a what now? A wedding soup? <laughs> yeah, I'd rather get a divorce if someone serves this to me. It's unique and interesting, but unfortunately, it just doesn't work for me. I'm gonna say no. Ugh. Okay, chef. <sighs> Phew, okay. I'm ready to take the criticism. Yes, and here it is. Uh, the dish was a letdown. A complete failure. It's a no. I like your attitude. Aw, thank you! I just don't like your dish. It's a no. I know I can do so much more! Please, just give me a chance to prove myself! Sorry, no. Goodbye. That way, please. Thank you. Uh, Viv? Are you okay? Uh, my stomach is in knots. I really don't know if I should actually push through. Come on, you'll do great. Didn't you hear what the judges said? You're one of the greatest cooks in the city. Shouldn't you be happy about that? First off, you're not the one who's cooking. I am, and it's stressing me out. Second, you think I'd be happy knowing that a self-righteous black-haired jerk is one of the judges? Self-righteous? What? You mean, the chef's and winner? Oh, you mean that hot judge. I'm kidding. <laughs> Damn, Gray, you're looking pretty hot today. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> How did you even know he's like that, though? Have you met before? I met him at the supermarket the other day. Uh, he had the nerve to humiliate me for not minding my things and texted me about it like it's a joke. How did he even get your number? He found my wallet and saw my ID. My number was written there. Wait, was that the reason why you sounded so worried on that phone call? Uh, I hate to admit it, but yeah, I dropped my purse that time so I was nervous while talking to you. <laughs> Luckily, he gave it back. Did you thank him for that? Oh, wait, I mean... Okay, that's it. I'm out. Wait! Gray, I'm sorry. Mallory, you better shut up. You're making your boyfriend jealous. Of course I did. But honestly, after what he did to me, I don't think he deserved any form of gratitude at all. Well, since that imbecile is a judge, why am I even here? I doubt that I would even get in. So why would I even bother doing this? Huh? Where are we going? Change of plans. I'm backing out. We're leaving. Wait. What? what? I said we're leaving. Let's go. You can't just back out like that. You've already signed up. Why don't you prove him wrong? 
Because I'm not going to waste my valuable time on him. Now come on. But what about the... The business? We'll find another way for that. But I thought you'd also do this because it's your dream. And I have more dreams that are way bigger than this. I have better things to do either way. Now, can we please just get out of... Ah! <sighs> uh, geez. How many times am I going to bump into people? <laughs> oh my, I am so sorry. Are you okay? No, I'm sorry. I wasn't looking in my way. And don't worry. I'm fine. Do you need any help? Oh my gosh, Zuri Miles! Uh, <laughs> looks like you know me. Of course, you're literally an icon. I love your videos. Aw, I'm flattered. Thank you. Um, what's your name? Oh, it's Vivian. Vivian Gomez. Ah, nice to meet you, Vivian. Looks like you're trying out for a jacket, too? Oh, uh, yeah, I am. Well, I wish you the best of luck, oh, then. OMG! It's Zuri! I can't believe you're here. You're my biggest inspiration. I can't believe I'm meeting you. Oh my gosh, Miss Zuri! Can we please take a picture right over there by the logo? Please? Ah, uh, well, <laughs> thank you all so much. And sure thing, I'll be right there. Sorry, Vivian, but I have to go. Nice talking to you, though. I hope to see you in the competition. Oh, no problem. Nice talking to you, too. Someone's starstruck. Oh, shut up. See? You gotta meet her because of this competition. Are you sure you want to back out? Look, I don't know, okay? I just don't want to be humiliated by him, nor be associated with anything involving him. With the way you say that, it kind of seems like you have feelings for him. Cut that nonsense out, Mal. Oh, come on. I get the same vibe like this in some movies and fanfictions. Who knows? This might be the start of an enemies to lovers kind of story. <laughs> Dear, this ain't some anime-like drama series, okay? Cut the blabber. Or is it? Well, if you back out, then who's gonna look like the loser here? You or him? Think about it. Besides, there's Chef Albert and Chef Lindsay. If you impress them enough, he wouldn't matter. Even if you do have bigger dreams than this, isn't it just a waste of time not to try? We're already here. This is exactly why I don't take chances for myself. Paging Miss Vivian Gomez. Please get ready. You have five minutes to prepare yourself. <sighs> Well, it's too late to back out now. Go get him! You know what? Let's do it. All right, I'm going in. Go, Come on, go. Let's, let's, let's go! go. Okay, Vivian, deep breaths. Whatever happens, make sure he won't bring you down. Just stay confident and keep your guard up all the time. Hello there. Hi. What's your name? My name is... Vivian? Yes, my name is Vivian. I didn't expect you to be here. Likewise, Chef Rivera. You two know each other? Not quite, but we ran into each other in the supermarkets the other day. I may or may not have caught her being a klutz that day. <laughs> Don't get too confident, sir. You haven't seen my capabilities yet. I think I've seen enough in our first encounter. <clears throat> so, Vivian, what will you be making for us today? Pan-seared filet mignon? With a red wine shallot reduction. You only have five minutes to get everything plated. Timer starts now.